your hair is not curly when it is out of the shower, then you do not have curly hair. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Brooklyn here and welcome back to my channel and another video. I hope you guys are all doing well and if you're living in Toronto, how good is the hot weather? Finally, I feel like I've been in winter for like a whole two years. <laughs> Anyway, in today's video, we are going to be doing another curly hair tutorial because you guys love that stuff and I love my curls. Also, this is going to be a very interesting hair tutorial for me because if you saw my last video, I recently cut my hair on my own for the first time in my life and I cut a lot of it off. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> so this is going to be a first reaction on camera of me with my new curls with the length that it is. But before we get on with the video, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. Don't forget to comment anything you want, subscribe to my channel and also turn on my post notifications. I love you guys so much and let's get on with the video. So this is how short my hair is now. This is uh, after and my before. These are the results and this is what it looks like. And it's honestly not the worst. It's not too bad, but I wasn't expecting to cut this much off. My hair was down to here. So I've cut like a big chunk of it off, but I feel like my hair needed it. So I'm really happy and it feels healthy now. Along with today's tutorial, I'm also gonna show you some new products that I bought and supplements that I take for my hair that are vegan of course so if you're interested in that then make sure you keep watching and give this a big thumbs up here we go oh my god look at my face what is this nonsense okay hi we are in the shower i'm in my bikini so the very first hair tutorial i did i was actually wearing clothes i was wearing like tights like are you dumb like what was i thinking anyway so this is my hair before I am not using my typical purple shampoo today. I am using a shampoo and conditioner that I haven't used on camera before, but it smells so delightful. And it's one of my favorites, but they are super expensive. So like, sponsor me, let's do a collab because I love your stuff and I love that it's customizable. So I'm gonna show you what I'm using now. So for our hair wash today, we are going to be using Function of Beauty and obviously Purple. My sister knows me so well. She surprised me with the Function of Beauty shampoo and conditioner when I went back home to Australia for a visit last year in May. And I don't know what she put in for me. I cannot remember. But I think obviously there's a toner because of my blonde hair. No frizz, probably dandruff, dry, frizziness. It's really cool. I love Function of Beauty. You can customize your stuff and the scent is amazing. I have the pineapple scent and I just feel like I'm at Bora Bora or something when I put it on. So I feel like transporting myself to a tropical island today. So that's what we're gonna do. And then today we're gonna be doing a hair mask. So I only wash my hair once a week. So I'm starting to do hair masks once a week as well because I was kind of really lazy and I used to do them, but I bought this hair mask, so this is the first time I'm using it today, and it's the Mark Anthony Grow Long. And obviously I got it because I just chopped all my hair off and I'm trying to be healthy and grow it really long so then my curls kind of stay healthy and beautiful and luscious. So we're gonna be using that. It has caffeine and ginseng in it for strength and protection. Mark Anthony and function of beauty. Let's wash. Where this thing is so good. Oh my god, the fog, no. Am I fogging again? No. Nope. Minutes? No. We are leaving this on for 45 minutes. 
But I mean, we're gonna leave it in for 45 because we're cool. We want to grow the hands because we just cut it along. So we need it to grow because my hair was so long. If you haven't seen it when it was purple, well, you gotta cause it was so long. Yeah, that's my song. Okay. So never brush from the top of your hair because that is not good. Always hold and brush. I'm going to show you how much hair I lose as well. Um, this wash, I have brushed my hair this week obviously because it was straight so I'm not going to lose as much hair as I normally do when it's curly because obviously I don't brush my hair when it's curly because it's curly and we all know what happens when you brush curly hair you get a frizzmania okay so oh, there's actually a fair bit there i'm actually lacking a lot of beach oil right now too so this is from us <laughs> i am the most real and raw person you'll ever meet and that's why i'm unique i've got really exciting projects coming up guys this smells so good it's very florally it's like a flower. Honestly, to all the curly girls that are like, if your hair is not curly when it is out of the shower, then you do not have curly hair. I'm sorry. Yes, I do have curly hair. And it's already like I'm getting some little curls coming up here, like waviness. So yeah, I do. So don't be mean. Like we should be supporting each other. We're in 2020 people, come on. Actually, I feel like my hair, Feels like what's like the a good way to describe it? It feels like baby bottom. That's why you should get that hair mask if you want your hair to feel like baby bottom. Do it. Oh my, look at that slip. Oh my stunning. Now we wait 30 to 45 minutes because we don't like to follow instructions. We like to make up our own rules. So we are going to wait 30 to 45 minutes. BRB. Oh, lashes. Hello, I'm freckled. <laughs> Guys, look at my freckles. This is from literally three days of sun in Toronto. When I lived in Australia, I literally had freckles all year round and I was so tanned. Now I'd be so white living in Toronto. God bless you Canadians. I feel sorry for you, you know, but I don't know what it's like to have sun. But in saying that, our sun is very, very dangerous in Australia. Like, very, very, very dangerous. So if you are not from Australia and you are planning to travel there once this whole quarantine thing is over, or you're just planning to travel there one day in your life, please make sure you wear sunscreen because after 10 minutes, you will be red and you will ruin your whole entire trip. So, yeah, wear sunscreen, wear sunscreen. So I'm back and normal a little bit. I'm still a little bit jittery, but that's fine. <laughs> I think I should always film when I'm in a weird mood because it's great content and clearly entertaining. Now we're gonna rinse off the hair mask and then conditioner. This is so so. Now we're gonna start. So first of all, I'm really nervous uh, to see my hair, but before I get on with styling my hair, I just wanted to talk about a few projects that I'm working on at the moment that I'm super excited about. So I want you guys to go over and follow me on Instagram. It's it's Brooklyn, just here. I'm working on a few projects. New music coming soon. Along with just some creative DIY stuff that I've been doing lately. So 
If you want to know what I'm up to, then head over to my Instagram right now. Also, just a quick note, all the products that I've used in today's video are available on my Amazon favorites, which is always linked down below for you guys to check out. I have a US store and a Canadian store, so you guys can go and buy the products that you think would suit you best. But the only product that is not available on there is Function of Beauty, so sorry, boo-boo. This biotin came with a lot of capsules, so I was like, I'm going to get this biotin. So the brand is Sports Research. It is a vegan biotin, and it is the capsules are liquid veggie soft gel made from tapioca. So there's like these little baby pearls. They look so cute. They recommend to just take one a day, but you can't overdose on biotin. So I took two. Um, there's 120, and this was like $28 on Amazon. But 120 capsules. And they only recommend one a day. So that is literally like four months worth of biotin. So, I mean, vegan, gluten-free, cruelty-free, tapioca, cute little balls, easy to swallow. So I already recommend it. And I'll keep you guys updated to see my results. So I've obviously had my hair in my microfiber for a little bit. I'll show you the products I'm using today first. So, obviously... We already used the Grow Long. Honestly, I highly recommend this. First time using it, but it's a repairing anti-breakage mask and it is so soft. I mean, the most beautiful mask I've ever used. Beautiful mask. This is good stuff, guys. Also on my Amazon store, so go check it out. That's where I got mine from. So first off today, we're gonna be using the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Leave-In Conditioner. As you guys know, I love this product so much. I use it religiously. We're also gonna be using a new product today by Mark Anthony also. And this is the Strictly Curls, the Curl Cream. I've been watching a bunch of videos, so I thought I'd try it out. A little Mark Anthony for you. And he is vegan and cruelty-free as well, just so you know. Um, also going to be using my Frisbee Gone Serum by Giovanni Cosmetics. You guys know I love that. And of course my Giovanni Cosmetics mousse. And my little tools I'll be using today are really disgusting. <laughs> Cute. Are they both really filthy? So tools that I'll be using today are these two brushes, which is my Dyson brush. And of course, my Denman brush, which is the holy grail. If you're a Kelly girl, you know. You know what? Okay. So, hair is kind of dry, which is not good. So, we're gonna go and get our little spray bottle so we can spray and wet that baby up. I also will be using this spray bottle, it's a mist bottle. Honestly, highly recommend best thing I've bought for my curls and also with these amazing products and tools I have listed I will be using my Dyson because you guys know I cannot live without it it's the best thing ever okay so we're gonna start off let's actually just brush the hair a bit I know I comb in the shower which I have always done um, but I'm just gonna but it just feels so good when you brush wet hair I mean I feel like a wet dog right now like a dog putting his head out the window, enjoying the breeze, you know? Okay, so I'm gonna part, what do I wanna part? Let's part the middle. Yeah, I mean, that's good enough. We'll part there. Okay, oh my God, my hair even looks healthier already. Oh, wow. Incredible. Okay. I know I've sectioned my hair off in other videos, but I'm actually really lazy, but I don't want to do it. I don't want to section it off. Please don't make me do it. Why not do it? Okay. I'm going to section the hair off. I can't believe my hair was actually so dead and I didn't even realize. It was like a year. Not good. Don't recommend. So first off, I'm going to go in with my spray bottle and just wet my hair a little more. Not too much. That's it. 
first things first, serum. Always, literally, makes my hair feel so good. I love this serum and I'm nearly out. I'm gonna have to buy more from Amazon. The best place on earth, literally. I love Amazon, I'm so obsessed. And I think I just caught it out Amazon when I said it was funny. I'm in with my leave-in conditioner first, like I said we would. That's enough, didn't put too, too much. You always find that one side of my hair always goes so much curlier and beautiful than the other. It just really decides what it wants to do on its own. I'm like, I am your mum, listen to me. Not to yourself. Mids to ends, always, I forgot to say that. Now that we have the leave-in conditioner all in our hair, we are going to go in with our new product, Strictly Curls Curl Cream. I'm not really good at this thing, so I forgot to put serum, so we're gonna put some serum. I like to put the serum at the top so it doesn't um, frizz, obviously. I don't actually normally use a curl cream. Um, it's quite slippery, can you see that? Yeah, that's slimy. Oh my god, that smells so nice! What the hell? I haven't used a curl cream with you guys and I normally don't, to be honest. Um, so this is new for me as well, so we'll see how it goes. So I just used all of that product on one side. And this has avocado oil and shea butter, so you can definitely smell something beautiful in there. I love the smell of this product, like low-key, you just want to use it more because of the smell of it. So now that we are all in action with our cream and our leave-ins, we're going to go in with our Denrin brush and you are going to go upwards a few times in the same area. This allows air and if we go downwards then that means your curls are just going to drop. We want them to be fluffy. And that was my dishwasher, so I'm sorry. Okay, next section. I want you to comment down below if you have curly hair and what curly hair gurus you guys like to watch because I also am on my hair journey and I love watching people as well. But I'm just teaching you guys some techniques that I have learnt along the way for the beginners and the newcomers and don't hate your curly hair it's beautiful I know for the longest time I never used to wear it curly because I never knew how to wear it curly because I was never taught how to wear it curly and now I know all these things and here we are on my curly hair journey. The bottom of my hair feels like it's getting a little dry now, which is also not good. Now that that is all in, you can see a bit of a wave happening. Okay, I'm really nervous, guys. It's been so long. Okay, I'm gonna do one more spray. Just. I feel like I need to, you know? Now we're gonna go in with our mousse. So people normally go in with a gel, which I should be doing, but I wanna save the gel that I have for my next curly hair tutorial because I'm gonna use the same line for the whole entire video to test it out and see how it goes and maybe do a dry test and a diffusing test. And we're going to scrunch this in. Sounds like I don't have enough moisture in my hair, so I'm kind of scared. But I do have enough moisture at the front of my hair, so. So 
this isn't like a typical mousse. It's, I don't know, it's like a, a softer mousse. I've used other mousses before and they're so thick and dense. And this is just really fluffy and airy. And honestly, it's a product that I'll recommend for forever probably because I love it. It's obviously cruelty free and vegan as well as is everything else that I'm using, but it's not heavy. You want to hear that? That is your best friend right there. I need to get some more mousse because I'm out. But you know what I mean? The texture of this mousse isn't, it's like a bubble bath really. It's not thick. Give this video a thumbs up if you're excited to see my curls short because I don't think I am. Definitely more moisture on this side, which is so weird. You also don't want to have too much product in your hair. I mean, because it'll weigh it down. This is my wet results and let's get diffusing. Camera memory card was too full, so I had to wait and import everything onto my computer. But in the meantime, I air dried for the first time, like, and now it's going pretty crispy, but normally I would just go over with my diffuser and hover until it gets crispy and hard like this crispy. What is this, food? So we're still going to hover because the back is still very wet. My hair is officially, as you can see, there's like a cast over my curl. So now I'm going to go in and cup my hair because it's pretty much dry to what I need it to be to start cupping. Oh my god! Like actual curls are coming back. Having curly hair is literally such a tedious task. For anyone that doesn't have curly hair that says, if you have curly hair, you don't need to do it. Like, you're so lucky. It's just like beautiful and... That's all I have to say. Oh my god, so short and curly. Curls. The underneath ones are like really my friend right now. I think I'm gonna let it air dry for the rest of it and I'll come back and show you guys once it's completely dry. All right, so I'm gonna air dry the rest of the way and then we can shake out our hair and pick it out with an africa so my hair is pretty much dry and there are a few curls that are very very happy see when i say that i'm like okay my hair is curly it's not wavy i just need to maybe put more product next time more leave-in anyway i'm gonna diffuse a little more and then we're gonna shake out my hair Oh my god, so there you have it guys, that is my new short curly hair routine with new products from Mark Anthony and also air drying a little bit. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, comment down below what you guys want to see next time and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up because it really helps my channel out. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video, okay bye! Oh, oh, oh.